everyone and welcome. Welcome to the play review for Target. TGT, this is Target Corporation, had a bullish gap up today. And the reason I want to do this video today is I called this, I called the two late trades in this today actually, this is exploding right now, uh, is that if this really defines everything that I know about gaps and, and what is happening here at Target today. So I think this is a really, really good learning example for a lot of people who are new to gaps or don't understand gaps, and so I want to go over it. I did not watch this out of the gate at all. I like to do my shorts in the morning. That's just what I like to do. <clears throat> but you can do golden gaps for a bullish as well, and I can read them extremely good just as well as the shorts. So anyways, Target was doing this today, this morning, and I said, oh, this is a good long. And I call this in here. And and it actually held perfectly where I said to put the stop. Look at that. So I call this in here. It was uh, a little bit big of a stop, but not really considering the actual price of this stock. It's over $70 for Pete's sakes. So the stop was at 40, 70, 40, and that held. And that's tight to put this on a long, but with Target, I felt that really it needed to hold that level. So I called it in here. Called it again right in here. I said, this is going to go. And then it retested in here and held, and look at how it took off. I mean, you actually had several chances to do ads in this as well today. Beautiful move to Target. I said 72, and then I did say dream Target, and this is 75. I said dream Target, and this is 75. This could get to 75 today. It's only 1130. It is 11.30 in the morning, and this could actually, this is $2 away from the dream target. 73.08. I'm not saying it gets there this morning right this second, but the minutes are out today at 2 o'clock, and it's a good idea to be flat at anything. But I did say, if you're going to be in something long today, if you're going to hold something long into the lunchtime period today, if you're going to, if I said, if you're going to be in a trade today into the lunchtime period, the trade to be in is long. And so I think the people that were in this decided to hold this then because I did say that that was good advice because it took off then after 11 o'clock is when it really exploded and here's all the profit. So once again, risk reward is there despite the fact it had a big stop. Why? Look at the move it made. This is power money. This is power money buying the stock. It's so, so clear. So the funny thing is somebody asked me about this the other night on Monday night after the webinar. They asked me what I thought about Target. I said, this is a great chart. It's a long. It's a long in here, so the next target $70. The stock gapped up to $70 today in the gap. And then I said $75, but, you know, you just don't know if it's going to necessarily get to that dream target. I mean, that's a dream target. It's a dream target. This is a beautiful chart. And that's all I have to say, basically. Um, so let's go back and look at this. One of the reasons I think this is a really good example of the power of gaps to use to trade and why I have 100% conviction that there is no other correct strategy to consistently make profit in the market as a day trader other than gaps is because gaps are something that have momentum and they move. And you can make good profits with good risk to reward in stocks that are quality gaps. The problem is that many people don't know how to trade gaps. Like, for example, Target today. I'm sure people looked at this to fade today, to come in today or short today because the stock closed last night at 67.51 and opened today at 69.95. It opened actually right at the next Target that I told that lady on Monday night, or it was a guy. I don't remember who it was. Somebody asked me, and somebody asked me, and I. That's amazing to me. Someone asked me on Monday night about this. I said the next Target seventy dollars. It opened to that Target today in the gap. I'm just so good at reading these numbers. You know the thing I was realizing today, I was really this, this today after the short. <clears throat> I have my entries perfect, my gap rating system perfect to pick the gaps. I know the targets perfectly. The thing is, just to know when they're going to get to that target. Because it's like sometimes things get to the dream target on the actual day, okay? Sometimes they go to it on the second day, and then sometimes they take longer. So, and this is because trading really should be looked at as an overall bigger picture thing. I think this is where you can combine the worlds of day trading and swing trading to be a very profitable trader. Because you would day trade the stock. You would have that target, which I know what the targets are, then 
if it doesn't get to that dream target or whatever on that day of the intraday, you hold a portion of that into the larger move to get it to the dream target. Because I know that they're going to get there then even when I see them. Like the market, like this, like many of my shorts. Uh, but anyways, that's how I think really to put everything together to be very, very successful. The thing is, a lot of people swing trade and they really have no idea how to take an entry position in a stock for an, a swing trade. They tend to be take it, take it at the wrong entry, then be down before they're up or up right away and then they're down and give it back and it's over and they take it too late. If you understand how to day trade gaps, you'll do better swing trading. This is the thing. This is what people have to understand. That's why learning gaps and learning my 26-point rating system makes a sense for any type of trading you do. Day trading, swing trading, or core trading. And Target is a great example of this. Beautiful day trades in here to the upside. And beautiful move in here for the fall through continuation if you held this for a swing trade. And just a nice chart, as I pointed out on Monday night. But I'm sure a lot of people were day trading didn't know what to do with this today. Because the market was running red this morning, intraday. Target gapped up overnight, $3 plus. People want to fade gaps or play gaps for gap fills. This is not what this was. This was a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful bullish gap to go long in. Look how many gaps this stock has had here, actually, in the last month. And this is this is what I'm talking about, the power of the gap. This, this here today. This is, I love this stuff. I love this stuff. So my golden gap rating system, I like. I prefer to short because I think a lot of people don't short, and I think it gives me an edge to short the market, and I'm really good at shorting. Uh, however, you can use the rating system to go long as well. So that's how I'm able to see something like Target and know that it's going to make a move like this before it even explodes and does what it did. So beautiful, beautiful long and golden gap in Target today. And there were people in the room that got this. Even with the size of the stop, it was a good risk to reward trade. That often happens. And again, the price point is over $70. You have to expect a large stop in something like this. And actually, 60 cents wasn't half bad for this. This could have been more. <clears throat> so this will make a new high before the end of the year. Uh, market is going to continue to rally before the end of the year. And that will help lift Target up to the 75 And the next number, $80, is even possible in Target now before the end of this calendar year, 2014, with this gap today. So really, really nice look to the target chart and a beautiful example of number one bullish gaps, which I rarely talk about, and the power of the gap itself if you have a high quality gap. You cannot just play gaps willy-nilly. They're so powerful that if you don't trade them in the right direction, you can lose big time. But if you trade them in the right direction, you can make money big time. Look, this is carrying through. Look at how nice this is. So important to learn how to trade. I think I, as I've talked to more and more and more and more people, people actually that don't know how to trade think that they know how to trade, and they don't. I'm realizing that talking to a lot of people. But what can you do? I think it's one of the pe reasons people don't do that well. They insist that they know how to do something. They continue to do what they, what they are doing. It continues to be not successful, or maybe they're break even, you know but they're not making what I call real money. And it's because people think they know what they're doing and they just don't want to learn anything else. And those people are destined to lose. You can really see that playing out now in the market. Uh, so the TGT is a beautiful bullish gap. And if you're interested in learning how to trade gaps and rate gaps, you can email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. The Golden Gap class is this week on November 22nd and 23rd. And I'm only doing one more class this year. I'm running a special till the end of this week. It's been very popular, so I continued it. If anyone is interested in signing up for the special, with the special, you get the room free for the rest of the year. And uh, a bunch of other good things, too. The swing trade letter, the trends class, the wealth manifestation class, and the total price for everything is $34.99. It saves you almost $1,600. So it's a really good deal. And you Take, you get the trends class, which teaches you how to re, reach, read longer-term trends, uh, which is very important if you do overnights as well. And it's important if you day trade. So nice bullish move here in the TGT. Good job, everybody that did this today. I rarely call longs in the room, but I did call this today. And the people that are in the room with me know that when I call along, if I call along, I call the market long. 
uh, yesterday. I called this long today. If I happen to call along, then it is good, 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 because I just will only call something that is absolutely, absolutely perfect that's long, because uh, I just, you know, usually don't do them. I usually do the shorts. Anyways, they work just the same. Have a great day, everyone. Email me at melissa at thestockswish.com if you want to sign up for the class this weekend. Deadline is Friday if you want to sign up. Today is Wednesday. Have a great day, everyone. See you tomorrow.